Once upon a time, there lived a handsome prince in his grand palace, which had beautiful gardens full of vibrant flowers in front. The prince loved going for long rides on his majestic horse, galloping through meadows and forests, always appreciating the beauty of nature. One day, as he returned from one of his rides, he encountered a mysterious sorceress who appeared in the palace gardens. She admired the prince for his charm and beauty, but she had a dark heart. The sorceress approached the prince, offering him unimaginable power in exchange for his hand in marriage. The prince, sensing her wickedness, refused. Enraged by his rejection, the sorceress's eyes glowed with fury. She raised her hands and cast a terrible curse on the prince. Since you do not agree to my offer, you will live in the form of a beast until someone loves you despite your frightening appearance. Only true love will break this curse. In an instant, the prince was transformed into a terrifying creature with fur, sharp claws, and fangs. The sorceress disappeared. Horrified by what he had become, he fled to his palace, which instantly changed into a dungeon. Years passed, and the beast's hope of breaking the curse faded. The forest around him grew wilder, and the once magnificent palace fell into ruin. However, the garden outside the palace remained beautiful with flowers. One day from a distant village, a young girl named Belle, who loved exploring nature and reading stories of adventure, ventured into the enchanted forest. She had heard tales of the beast, but her curiosity and kindness pushed her forward. As she wandered through the trees, she stumbled upon an overgrown path leading to a mysterious garden. It was filled with flowers that seemed to glow, even though the rest of the forest appeared dark and eerie. Belle was drawn to the beauty of the flowers and, without thinking, she reached out to pick a single rose. But as soon as she did, a deep growl echoed through the trees. The beast emerged from the shadows, towering over her with his fierce appearance. Who dares to steal from my garden, he roared. Belle's heart raced with fear, but she bravely stood her ground. I didn't mean to steal. Your garden is so beautiful. I'm sorry, she said softly. The beast was taken aback by her calmness. You are not afraid of me? Belle looked into his eyes and replied, You may look frightening, but I can see there's more to you than just your appearance. You must have a kind heart to care for such a beautiful garden. The beast, surprised by her words, invited her to stay and talk for a while. Belle, sensing the sadness in him, agreed. Day after day, she returned to the forest to visit the beast, and they spent hours together, exploring the woods and talking about the wonders of the world. As time passed, Belle began to see beyond the beast's appearance. She saw his kindness, his protectiveness over the animals, and his love for the natural world. The beast, in turn, began to care deeply for Belle, for she was the first person who had ever treated him with compassion since the curse. One evening, as the forest glowed under the setting sun, Belle turned to the beast and said, You are not a monster. You're a good friend, and I care for you deeply. At that moment, a magical light surrounded the beast. The curse was breaking. The fur, claws, and fangs faded away, and the beast was transformed back into the handsome prince he had once been. Belle gasped in surprise. You're the prince from the stories. The prince smiled, his heart full of gratitude. Thanks to your kindness and love, you have broken the curse. Together, they returned to the palace, restoring the beauty of the gardens and filling the once lonely halls with joy. The prince and Belle lived happily ever after, reminding everyone that love and kindness can break even the most terrible curses. The moral of the story is that true love looks beyond appearances and kindness can change even the darkest of hearts. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel if you liked the video.